What's going on guys, Nico back here with another Madden video, and in today's video, we're going to be going over the Ravens team team, we have two huge upgrades coming, or that, you know, came with the Sugar Rush promo, if you guys happen to enjoy the videos, make sure to leave a like, hit the subscribe button, turn the bell on, and follow me on Twitter, links in the description, make sure to check out the last two videos we uploaded, we did a gameplay with the new Lamar Jackson, and we, and we, you know, we pulled four extravagant eggs, which I will go over later in this video, you know, things I've been hearing about them. And let's get into this team. So we have Lamar Jackson, the quarterback, obviously. He's going to be our new quarterback. I told you guys early on in, in this series that he would be my in-game quarterback because, you know, he's Lamar Jackson, my favorite player in the NFL. He's 99 speed, 98 throw power, 99 short, 97 medium, 97 deep, 97 throw under pressure, 99 throw on the run, and 99 pass accuracy. He is the best quarterback in the game. He doesn't even get any of the boost from the Ravens team team. Uh, the speed's already there. He gets strength in jumping, but I don't really think that means anything. He also has 99 spin, 99 juke, 99 and break sack. He is... In my opinion, the best quarterback in the game. We have Gunslinger, Howard Master, Fearless on him. No escape artist. I don't like. I don't, I don't really, you know, like using it. Receivers are still the same. Rashad Bateman, Deion Sanders, Devin Hester. Running back is Priest Holmes. Uh, I think he's better than Ricky Williams. He catches the ball a lot better. We have Brian McKinney, Bradley Bozeman, Jensen, Zeitler, and Orlando Brown on the O line. Darren Waller at tight end, and then Hugh Sheck at fullback. I think I'm going to pick up Mark Andrews and CJ Mosley, guys like that. I think I'm going to pick them up on Easter morning when the eggs hatch. Obviously, their prices will be way down since, you know, we have a couple of Redux eggs that will hatch. So that is the offense. Defense, we got Yannick Ngakwe right here. And the Ravens theme team boost definitely help him. Um, I don't usually acknowledge that he was a Raven because he was really awful when he was on the Ravens. But, you know, he had a nice bounce back here with the Raiders, so good for him. But we do get his card here, 92 speed, 98 excel. Very nice. 96 finesse move. I wish the power move was at 90 at least, but it's not. Um, he's 96 block shot, 95 tackling. Uh, he's a very, very, very solid guard. Um, and he also has 97 hit power. So, Ngakwe right, th right there is another is a you know good defensive end upgrade for the Ravens team team, which is what they need to get Derek Wolf out of here. So now the Ravens pass rush is not bad at all. Uh, you know you have Clay's Campbell at, at DT and then Ngakwe and you, I guess like Judon off the edge. Um, Corners are still going to be Dion, Devin Hester, and Marlon Humphrey. I want Marcus Peters to get an upgrade. He needs one. Um, Devin Hester, you know, he's still fine though. He get, you know, he gets 99 speed. Safeties, we have Ed Reed and Bernard Pollard back there. We have Marcus Williams and Chuck Clark as our users, and then we obviously have Ray Lewis pass rushing as well. We still have Justin Tucker and Randall Cunningham back here, and that is it. Um, uh, did the controller just die? It did. So. I'm going to cut, I'm going to get new batteries, and I'll be back. Alright guys, we are back, and I, what, what I was going over is guys like Chuck Clark and guys like that. We can go over their stats, you know, really quickly, just to make, you know, to update you guys. Marcus Williams got Ravens chem last week, and he is now 97 speed with 96 zone. Um, as he, He's probably not the best user. Um, he is six foot, one, 6 foot 1, though, so he's not, you know, short by any means. Um, I feel a lot more comfortable using, using him than Ed Reed, because Ed, Ed Reed is 5'11". The 2 inches definitely helps there. Um, DT, we still have Haloti Nada, Brandon Williams. I don't know when Haloti Nada is going to get an upgrade. We just got William Perry, so they're probably pushing it back. Uh, obviously, when, you know, with Ultimate Legends and stuff. I'm guessing he's going to be in the Ultimate Legend promo. Maybe I'm wrong. I'm, I'm guessing I'm not. And then that is really it. So, there have been rumors about the eggs, right? So, the upside down egg is rumored to be fullback Robert Hunt, 97 overall, something like that. And then there is a purple dark purple egg so it's really only raven's colors number 30s on it and it's got a a compass on it i I, th I thought it was pointing west so i'm not really a wet okay never mind it makes sense now that i'm thinking about it. i didn't really think about it before i said it um it's a compass pointing west chris westry is number 30 on the ravens and he was the guy that tackled robert hunt or tried to make the tackle on robert hunt when you when you know like that you know iconic play that really should have never happened it should have been blown dead as soon as robert hunt touched the ball but um, Chris Westry was in that play, and he is going to be a decent corner if he does get a card. I'm pretty sure he's 6'2", something like that. So Chris Westry would be a good corner. He is obviously a Raven. Um, so that's a, an egg that I rumored. I'm going to try to get that egg. If I can't, then I'll just end up buying him uh, when he comes out. But it does look like that's going to be Chris Westry. And then the upside down egg that has like the Dolphins colors is Robert Hunt. The eggs that we have, you guys saw, obviously, we pulled four extravagant eggs. We also have one large egg. And then, so, this one, I've seen people say Charles Woodson. It, Woodson. It's got Michigan colors. It has a trophy, it looks like, in the front. I, I don't really know. Um, people are saying it's wide receiver Charles Woodson. Um, so, we'll have to see about that. I did get two of, like, the really rare eggs, you know, like the 62,000 quick sell. People have told me this is 99 Patrick Mahomes. I don't know how they got to that conclusion. There's no, like, hints on this egg at all. Um... 
really, yeah, there, there really isn't. Um, like, I, I don't even know where to look for a hint. Like, you can't, I, I don't really, like, see anything on that egg. So, I'm not sure. Uh, I do have a blue one that's worth 62000 And this one I do agree with. There's, you know, berries on the bottom. You know, like, blueberry, raspberry. Um, and it's a blue egg. People are saying it is 99 Barry Sanders, which I agree. I honestly do agree. Um, I do think that's Barry Sanders right there. And then this one is a Redux egg. It says Redux in there. I don't think you guys can see. Actually, you guys can see it. Um, it does say Redux on the bottom there. It's like very, f you know, faint, but you can see it. It does say Redux on there. So this is going to be probably a 98 to 99 Redux, or a 97 to 99 Redux um, right there. I also have a large Redux egg, which I'm not going to get rid of. I could. It's 16,000 candy, which isn't bad. Um, I do want to try to pull the... Um, the Chris Westry egg though, so well, I, I might have to come back over here and make some coins. I, I haven't really been on here at all, like really at all, you know, playing this game or sniping. Uh, I've been on obviously MLB, but this, I mean, I mean, if 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 Chris Westry is coming out, I do have to pick him up uh, for the team. But again, we do have four extravagant eggs. I don't really want the Charles Woodson one, or I mean, I'm gonna keep the two rare ones and the Redux one. I don't really need the Charles Woodson one. Um, so if if it is like actually Charles Woodson, then. I would consider getting rid of it, but I, I don't. I'm, I'm not guaranteed another extravagant extravagant egg, so I'm not really sure there uh, how that would work. But that is the team, obviously. On, on the main team, uh, if you guys were wondering, like 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 you know who to fill in for the Ravens team, team we can go check that out as well um, on who you can possibly put. You know, if you're doing like a like a half, not 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 a half Ravens team, but if you have like spots open that you want to fill with different players. I have Devontae Adams. He, he gets Ravens cam. Obviously, if it wasn't a strict Ravens team, team, Devontae Adams should be on every single team. He gets every single team cam. And then I have Warren Sapp and Travis Kelsey. That's just me personally. It's post up for it's, it's two post ups for two AP instead of four. So you get the discounted right there. And the rest is the same. The offensive line's the same. The receivers are the same. Bateman and Sanders. And then Holmes at running backs the same. Waller at tight ends the same. Defensively, uh, there are a couple changes here. I have Taylor Mace here at free safety. Um. Right there, I have Ed Reed at cornerback three. I have Davenport obviously on the on the D line, and then I have Cam Chancellor back here as well. Obviously, he gets Ravens cam. Davenport gets Ravens cam. Mays gets Ravens cam. So there's not really any like there's there's not really any players that don't get Ravens cam that are on this team. It's just players that didn't play for them uh, that are going to be on this team here. And then specialist, yeah, you can see Cam Chancellor. Cam Chancellor is back here, and then that is it. We we just have the speed cams as well, and. I don't really have anyone else. I, I obviously, if, if I was building the best team, you know, in the game, Reggie Bush would probably be my running back. Uh, the offensive line would be all gold 99. Tight end would probably be Antonio Gates now, since he's probably the best tight end in the game now. Um, corners, obviously, I would I would have Jalen Ramsey here. You know, guys like that. And we we, we can also go take a, a look at the market really quick as well. I said uh, I, I I I was predicting Lamar Jackson would be around 300k. He started at 360k around like around that range. I bought him for 424, um, and then like an hour later, he shot up to like 600k. I don't know why. Like I, I honestly couldn't tell you why he shot up that much, but he did. You can see training is so cheap right now. 98 for 200k, just so cheap. But let's come over here to Sugar Rush, which is actually gonna be up here. And I should probably should not be at newest, but I'm pretty sure they're still at like 500k. Uh, yep, Ramsey's at 490, Lamar's at 520. So these guys are, have skyrocketed in price. Uh, these masters are pretty cheap. Once I come back over here and make some coins, we'll probably pick up Bush and Calvin. Uh, I just haven't, you know, been over here making coins, obviously, uh, which I should be doing. I, I should probably get get it done this week. I will, you know, shoot for it to, you know, come over here maybe for like a couple hours a day and make some coins since we are going to need them on Easter morning if I want to do what I want to do. Um, but yeah. If you guys are trying to build a team, like it's it's really easy now. Uh, Charles Haley is super cheap, and he's one of the best pass rushers in the game. Uh, you can see here a bunch of these guys are just really cheap. Moss is 290k. Obviously, getting the free pack from the solos, which I haven't done yet. I need to go do those solos. I think I only have two more to do um, to get the free 98. Obviously, is so worth it. Um, the most expensive le ultimate legends. I don't really know who they are. Um, the most expensive ones that you could get out of there. We come over here and look. Haley is the cheapest uh, for the 98. So obviously, you don't want a 97. The most expensive, though, Pouncey's uh, 300K. Mike Haynes is 300K. 
Um, and then that might be it. Um, it's looking like 300k is really what you're aiming for out of that. Uh, you can see Antonio Gates here is 600k, uh, but you know obviously you can't pull him. So really, you're aiming for like a 300,000 coin card. I'm, I'm gonna go probably do the solos right now. I totally forgot that they were out, so I'm probably gonna do this right now. If you guys did enjoy the video, make sure to leave a like, hit the subscribe button, turn the bell on, follow me on Twitter. The links in the description. That's the Ravens Steam Team. If you guys have been keeping up through all throughout the series, you've seen uh, since about I, I want to say j we started in February. Now it's april so it's been two months and we've done a bunch of ravens team videos go check them out playlist will be in the description as well i'll see you guys in the next one see ya